The order by the judge for the former governor of Kebi State to appear unfailingly before him came after the former governor and one other defendant failed to appear to take their plea in a case of money laundering, even after being served with the notice of summons by the prosecution. Justice Amobeda, Simon, who had earlier thrown out an objection filed by the defense counsel for the court to strike out the case, said the prosecution were able to produce evidence of service of the notice of summons, and the defense were not able to convince the court why their prayer should be granted. Thereafter, the prosecution counsel, Mr. Johnson Ojogbaro, moved a motion for the defendants to take their plea before the court, but the defense counsel informed the court that three of the defendants, Alhaji Saeed Nusa Mutakingari, Mr. Sonde Dogonyaro, and Alhaji Abdullah Yaba, were not in court, while the third defendant, Alhaji Rabiu Garba Kamba, is in attendance, but prayed that the court should adjoin the case to a later date for the defendants to be able to appear for their plea. However, the prosecution counsel, Mr. Johnson, countered their application, saying the defendants have made it a tradition to disregard the order of the court and hence should be issued with an arrest warrant and be made to appear on the next sitting. However, the judge said, considering the appeal by the defense and their undertaking to ensure that their clients appear in court, he refused to grant the prayers of the prosecution, but gave a stern warning that failure by the defendant to appear on the next due date, the judge will be forced to invoke Section 394 of the Criminal Code and issue an arrest warrant against the two defaulting defendants. Speaking to journalists after the day's sitting, both the prosecution and defense counsels said they were satisfied with the turn on events. Satisfied with how things have come. The only satisfaction is that they are not in court to be arrayed so that we can make progress. I'm hoping and praying that by the 2nd of July they will submit themselves to the decision of this court so they can be arrayed and we can start a trial eventually. That's where we are today. Are you satisfied with the turn on events? Yeah, we are very much satisfied. It could be recalled that the Economic and Financial Crime Commission, the EFCC, instituted a criminal case of money laundering against the former governor of Kebi State, Alhaji Saeed Nasamu Daikengari, and three others, namely Abdullah Hiaba, Rabi Ukamba, and Sunday Dogonyaru, for allegedly receiving and laundering 700 million naira received from the former Minister for Petroleum, Mrs. Dizaini Alison Madweke. Hamza Galadi Mazuru, Liberty News from Berlin Kebi.